Hello, comrades, and welcome to the seventh iteration of the Rise of Djibouti. That's right, number seven. And boy, am I glad to be here. That's right. I'm actually enjoying this series more and more to the point where I actually want to see how it concludes. Am I going to be steamrolled by some powerful United States-led coalition of countries that want me dead? Or, alternatively, am I going to succeed in conquering the world one tiny nation at a time? Well, we're going to find out. This is Episode 7 of The Rise of Djibouti. As of the last episode, we have conquered Amman. We are doing pretty good in all sectors. The people are happy. Stability is high. We are making money. Our tourism is still not rising as high as I would like it. Apparently, no one has the money to come to my amusement parks. Unfortunately, you should call this the Six Flags of Saudi Arabia. That's right. Beautiful, beautiful. But aside from that, the main threats we are now faced with is everyone! As per usual, everyone hates me. India, not as much as others. And the United States, not as much as others. As per usual, Europe is pretty still on good terms with me. You know, because I just took over Amman and annexed them within a short period of time. So we just have the European powers to really be afraid of. Which really isn't that big of a deal at all. <laughs> Not really. What is important to point out here, though, is that the population of Djibouti is 64 million. Our per capita is 37,000 per citizen, which is awesome. That means we are moving up in the world, us Djiboutians, and we are currently paying off some excess debt, which is also a very good thing. Let's see if we can have a little fun, shall we? Let's see if we can't take one of our spies and send them to Yemen and create some convoluted plot to overthrow their government. Yes, yes. This should be absolutely exciting. Alright, so let's see. What will we make Bonded James do? Well, let's start some grand old espionage, shall we? On his military... Mm. Let's frame, mm, let's see, Albania. Yes, because Albania would clearly commit such a vile act of treasonous activity to Yemen. Because, I mean, come on, since when did Albanians like Yemen? I look away for five seconds and Argentina's at war with Luxembourg. Now, how the hell does that happen? Alrighty, it looks like Bonded James is ready to execute his submission. Let's do it and see what happens. Ah! Mission failed! You failed me, Bonded James. You failed me. That's alright. We'll do it again. You are an elite spy. Let's see. Let's do... Assassination. Medium complexity, and let's blame Andorra. Because clearly Andorra would have something to say about that, wouldn't they? Mm, yes. All right, round two, Bonded James. Execute your mission. It was a success, and we blamed Andorra for it. So now, Yemen doesn't like Andorra as much. Let's see the fools. Yes, look at the tiny nation of Andorra. They're covered by Spain. How they, how they even managed to afford to commit the assassination is beyond me, but who cares? Let's keep on fucking with Yemen. Alright. Let's do a coup d'etat. Oh, oh, this is going to be great. We're going to blame... Uh, 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 let's totally blame Andorra for this one. Come on, we can do this. Come on, come on. Oh, this is going to be great. Alright. Alright, fingers crossed. Oh man, oh man, come on, come on! Ah, oh, damn it, it failed! Come on, let's do it again. Coup d'etat all around, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, here we go. Round five, I think. 
Let's do this. Come on, come on. Damn, it failed again! Alright, this time we're sending a couple spies in to do the dirty work. We're gonna send... Oh, we... Oh, this guy can't commit a coup d'etat. Alright, whatever. We'll terrorize them. And we're gonna blame it on... Afghanistan. That's right. And that one dude in spy movies. Oh, no, 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 no! Oh, no! I don't wanna co... No, cancel! I didn't realize you're not in Yemen. Oh, man. No wonder I couldn't do it. I'm an idiot. Wow, I almost committed an act of terrorism upon myself. Hmm. Hmm. That wouldn't have been good at all. You'd really think that after all these unsuccessful attempts to kick these people out of power, that, you know, they'd beef up their security, their spy security. But then again, it must be pretty good because they've managed to stop me multiple times now. Hmm. We shall see. Alright, that one dude in spy movies that always has an eye patch and Bonded James are both ready to execute their mission. Go! Ah, oh, the first one failed. Alright, come on, that one dude in spy movies with the eye patch. You've got this! You can do this! No! He's been captured! Oh, this is terrible! I think we should play a song for him. This is a sad, sad day for Djiboutians everywhere. We have lost a great national hero who on his very first mission failed and now we are stuck with this. <sighs> I'd like to take a moment of silence for that one spy dude in spy movies that always has an eye patch. Right back to it then. Execute mission. No! We lost Bonded James too! Oh my god! Yemen is like a death trap for my spies! Ah! Ah, uh, screw you, Yemen! Now I can't give up. I have no choice but to keep sending crap your way. You know what? I don't even have time for this anymore. Cause you know what I'm gonna do? Hey, Yemen. You're looking mighty pretty there. Over the border! Damn right I declare war. This country was mine to begin with. Yes, yes. Go forth! Sell it forth! Yes, I don't even think this is like my revamped army. This is like my weak one. There you go. Right, they're sending all their soldiers converging on our location. Let the war begin! We don't even have to fight anymore. We just win. win oh god, we're losing a lot of fighter craft aircraft though. Victorious conquer this country. Yes, yes. Annex Yemen. Bring them into the greater Djiboutian Empire. Oh my god, Yemen! Jesus! Oh! Oh man! Healthcare's gotta go back down again. Mm, that's a shame, that's a shame. Yemen has joined Djibouti. That's right. Look at this. Look at this. There is no longer a Middle East. It is only Djibouti. That is right. Except for Iraq, and Jordan, and Israel, and Egypt, and Lebanon, and Qatar, and Bahrain. But those do not matter! Not at all, not at all. And the United States, because for some reason they just... They still own a lot. They do. We'll fix this. It will be rectified over time. As we claim our place as the most powerful power that ever powered the power. You know what? I do believe Djibouti needs a new hat. Let's just go ahead and take them over. Charge, brothers! For amusement parks! There is no one in this world who can stop me from grasping my destiny over the border! Yes, yes. <laughs> Infantry, that's, what, that's really what you're going to try to stop me with? Infantry? 
wow, what a bunch of punks. Take this country over. I don't have time for this nonsense. No. Well, see, look, they've got tanks. Okay. They've got a little bit of an army. Just a little bit. Oh, no, they're doing some damage. Look at these guys go. Oh, I like this. This is exhilarating. They're actually hurting me. It's a fun hurt. Look at that, look at that. They actually, they actually shot down 137 aircraft and 1,828 vehicles. That's like a record for anybody. No one else has come close to such numbers. Yes, yes, yes. This is quite a beautiful hat. And you know what? Iraq's looking rather vulnerable, too. Yes, 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 yes. But we did lose a lot of our Air Force, so... I don't know. I don't know. Bring on the secondary army and bring Iraq down. Oh, oh I pissed off Russia. Oh, man. We've, we've, we've got a... We've got a couple of people who don't like us now. All right. Well, that's just great for us. Cause we're gonna conquer them. Let's see who all is at war with us. Ooh, look. Ooh, they're sending in their fleets. Oh, slow this bad boy down. Let's bring out what I've been hiding from the world. The jewel of Djibouti, as well as the new destroyer classes Let's see how well they hold it's the might of another come on come on there you go Let's see oh, who is this Iraq and whoever else a bunch of punks as far as I'm concerned they can't handle my navy I bet Russia's bringing something oh they are look oh they're coming full force Move in the Djiboutian army. Bring down Iraq. Right, let's speed this back up a bit. Here it comes, here it comes. There's the main army. Boom. Boom. Oh. <laughs> One infantry loss. Shame, shame. Let's see how we're doing against Russia. Oh, yeah. Big fleet you got, Russia. Mine's tougher. Doesn't matter how much crap you've got, you can't handle my technological superiority. That's right. and aircraft carriers for the win. Well, this looks like it could go on forever. Right, here we go. Alright, we're looking down here. Oh, wipe those out. Oh, there go all their frigates. <laughs> really, the one thing I might be concerned about is the ballistic missile submarines. They sure do have a lot of those. That's what my destroyer should be able to do. Full assault! Bring him down! Okay. Well, that's boring. <laughs> let's just let them do their thing. And let's conquer Iraq. Boom. Iraq and Jordan are both under our thumb now. Let's go back and look and see how our sea battle's going. Eh, about the same. I should get some of those ASW helicopters. Let's see if there's any on the market real quick. Nope, 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 there's not. Oh, they got frigates. We could buy those, maybe throw those in. Those might have an effect. Some submarines, attack submarines, the Gotland, the Daphne class, Kilo class. Alright, a bunch of losers. Oh, we won! Let's take a look at our victories. 255 Russian ships destroyed for only 9 Djiboutian. And 36 Iraqian and whatever that country is. For only 5 Djiboutian ships. Per kill ratio. Whoever those guys were did better. Now let's toss in all these extra ships. To see how they do. Merge. Who's attacking me? Who's attacking me? Oh, it's the Russians again. This time they brought their own aircraft carrier. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh no. They destroyed all my reserve ships that I just brought in. Oh, this is good. 
it's basically up to my aircraft carriers to save the day. Well, we'll just keep letting them duke it out. And let's hope that my navy wins. Because I've got a lot of enemies now. Let's see if maybe I can get out of a war with them. Let's see. Which one am I in? This one, yeah? This one, yeah. Turkmenistan, Algeria, Brunei. This is looking desperate. Will we win? We may lose. This may be the end of the Djibouti and Navy. With only the Jewel of Djibouti fighting still. Tune in next time, guys. And find out if we win. I am so broke. And I don't even think... Wow. The population is only 460,000. Oh. My. God. <laughs> what have I gotten myself into? Whew. Alright, well, to start, we are getting rid of all research. There will be no research in Dijibouti. 